How's it going, lads? Phil Paulo here, and welcome to the second episode of the second season of Road to Better Bollocks FC. Now, obviously, that is a bit of a mouthful, so I don't really want to be saying that every single episode, uh, so I'll just mix it up a bit. But anyway, uh, here is our first opponent, and he's got uh, pretty much a half, just over half an English squad uh, bronze team, so it's okay team, but I'm not. it doesn't really bother me too much, because I have this beast of a man. Adel to wrapped in form. Uh, now look, just keep an eye on where I aim this free kick, okay? So it's that side of the goal. We're aiming to the left side, and he goes to the other side, and uh, McLaughlin finishes it fairly nicely, to be honest, but he is an absolute shite player. He's 50 rated bronze CAM. He's crap. He's got the first touch. I've seen the better first touch on a pedophile, let's just say, um, but it doesn't matter. We got the goal, and that's all that matters. Uh, Mr. Hine. Oh, Hine! Uh, as I said yesterday, I love him. He's actually a very solid CDM, and he does the job. Um, now, thank God the ref blew the whistle there because that was probably the worst attempt on goal I've ever seen. And uh, we kind of took advantage of him having a rubbish goalkeeper and me having a monstrous player in inform at El Tarat. And we just went near post and his keeper was so bad he couldn't, you know, react. Um, but that's fine, enough. you know, I don't mind. Now, this is a good effort from Adel to as well. So you can see I've got potential here to get some nice clips, but I just need to up that chemistry. Now, I asked, uh, you know, who will I sign in the last video? Unfortunately, I actually signed a few players before I uploaded the video yesterday. So I've signed a couple of players in this episode, but don't worry, I'll listen to you from now on. Um, but a lot of people wanted me to do a hybrid team. And that actually makes quite a lot of sense, and I think I probably should do that because uh, otherwise I'll have an absolutely woeful Moroccan defence and goalkeeper combination, and I'll probably lose a lot of games. But uh, I think to start off, I will buy like the basics of a Moroccan defence and then work up to a bit of a hybrid team. You know, I think that's what makes sense the most. But uh, I just wanted to buy a centre back, uh, a Moroccan centre back, and this guy is 43 pace. Uh, so, oh Jesus Christ, he's 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 not too bad though. It doesn't bother me too much. But look at this squad. I'm playing against a team with Santi Cazorla, all these kind of players in Division Five. I go, why? You know, this lad is acting the bollocks. But uh, there's a lovely ball roll there from Hoyne. He did the business with that stuff. Uh, and look at this bullshit uh, with Santi Cazorla just acting the bollocks, and he nearly scored here. Uh, the keeper is just, a tr you know, he actually makes a good save there, but he's usually. I swear to God, he is useless. I mean, this t I'm going to throw up images of a few things that are more, you know, useful than that, that goalkeeper, okay? So we've got a bowl of cornflakes. Uh, I'm just dis disconnected there. We've got a bowl of cornflakes, cauliflower, I'd say a spoon, an inflatable dartboard. These are all these things that I think are better than my goalkeeper at the moment. They'd be better sticking them in goals. Uh, but look, here's EA trolling me. They said one title. And I, I thought, you know, Jesus, if I won a title in two matches, that'd be pretty, pretty good. But I buy this CAM as well. I can't actually remember what his name is. Uh, but I'll have that in the description. Don't worry about that. Um, but he looks okay. And then look at this team I come up against. And I'm literally pulling my hair out, pulling my pubes out. Uh, to be honest, I wouldn't mind a bit of a... You know, trimming down there, if you know what I mean. Anyway, so it didn't bother me too much. But um, <laughs> we almost score a goal there with Shirsbjerski or something. I can't remember what his name is. Um, but we get, we actually do get through. It was a lovely little ball there. And uh, Kosa, I think his name is Kosa, uh, does the business. Your man expects a tramp into my, you know, beastie in form to wrap. But it doesn't matter because we s slot the ball away. Now, look at this. Thank God I didn't concede here. What was I doing? Oh my God, thank fuck for that. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I would have been so pissed off myself if I conceded there. But uh, look at this, this was so frustrating. It's just a little kind of, what would you call it, twinkle toes run he did with Mario Balotelli and I couldn't get the ball off him. And uh, this was a very frustrating game. Actually, if, if this was the game I did the face cam uh, on, then you would see how frustrated I was. I usually don't get frustrated, but I knew this guy was rubbish, right? He basically was a crap player with a good team. And obviously, I didn't have a good team at the time. Or I still don't, but uh, yeah, you'll see. Look at this from the goalkeeper. That's what I was talking about earlier. I would honestly rather either like a bit of cauliflower or a bowl of cornflakes in goal to do a better job but there's a lovely bit of play from Mesa Oud and uh, have a look here in the box and just keep your eye on the box where's the penalty there I don't know but I will take it um, that was absolutely ridiculous like I dragged his player down and I got a penalty and we obviously get the dirty kind of down the middle penalty because they pretty much always work and uh, look at this bullshit 
straight away from tip he gets his goal the one two is just destroying me i couldn't do anything about it and uh look at this and else wrapped and nearly gets uh f you know it gets us to take the lead in the 83rd minute but then he goes down i do something stupid with my keeper what are we doing i'm so stupid <laughs> oh jesus anyway yeah i'm a, a bit of a retard we lose that game and obviously that's unfortunate we end up signing basufa and uh, a moroccan left back who's got 77 pace and he only cost me 150 coins as well so um you know, obviously a few people wanted me to get Basufa anyway. A few people want me to get the Inform version now. I won't be doing that for quite a while because of the lack of coins, obviously. And we come up against this team who's got Morata and Cavani up front. He's got Johan Caboy. So he's got a few solid players up there in there. And a lovely bit of play from Basufa on his debut. Look at that stuff. Ball rolls all over the place and scoop turns. And he probably should have scored, to be honest. Now look at this play from me with this Foglio guy. Bronze lad beautiful stuff jesus if i had scored that i think i would have taken that down and put it in another fifa fridays uh but there's the halftime stats so kind of slightly better possession more shots but look at this finish from Morata. i thought he was going to cross it in uh, to Cavani, and he absolutely destroys me there's no doubt about that and uh, Morata, once he scored his first he couldn't fucking stop scoring <laughs> unfortunately for me um and you'll see here my defender just didn't jump because he does, doesn't like jumping, obviously, the big bollocks. But, uh, you know, so I was 3-0 down and, you know, I was kind of shit my pants. And then I scored an absolute great goal here. Look at that. Whoa, what a beauty of a goal. Uh, <laughs> you don't save those, says Martin Tyler. And look at this. Oh, fucking hell. Uh, I, I just was like, this is not my day. But uh, things are looking bright. Things are looking like big bag of oranges and uh, Rupert. Jesus, whoever this guy is, I, it was his first game for me. I, just he's like a bronze Spanish lad, and he was doing the business. And I had to get that dirty goal, make made it three all. Unfortunately, that was it. It finished three all, but I'm happy enough with that. So at the moment, we've won two, drawn one, and lost. So I'm not overly happy with the record, but it doesn't matter. That's it for today's episode. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed it, and I uh, look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Yeah, honey, honey, honey. Oh, he's through. Oh, beautiful finish. Oh, Hein. Oh, Hein. <laughs>